Okay, we're over here at GoToMath.com. Click on the algebra. Let's go down to factoring polynomials. And uh, I believe we're doing 9.2. And let's see if we can get 9.2 to come up. There it is. There she blows. What's going on there? I don't know. X to the fourth. Oh my god. So we have x to the fourth minus 8x cubed minus 27x plus 27 times 8. Not sure why that didn't get multiplied together. Probably going to try to help us out somehow. All right, let's get over here to the y board. So we have x to the fourth <clears throat> minus 8 x cubed it is minus 27x plus 27 times 8 hmm. trying to figure this out let's see x like I said, these could be puzzles. Um, X and 8. Okay, what if we did this? We factored out an X cubed over here. So this becomes X minus 8. How's that? And let's say we factored out a negative 27. So this becomes X minus 8. See that? See, negative 27 times x is negative 27x. Then negative 27 times negative 8, and that's the reason that's not multiplied together. Because if it was, well, I guess it could be. You know, probably should be. But I think we're just trying to help you out there. And then now what we can do is factor out this x minus 8 out of here. And we're left with x cubed minus... 27. So once again, we have a difference here of two cubes. x cubed, remember, minus a cubed. And so a in this particular case is going to end up being 3. Right? 3 cubed is 27. Okay, so we're going to end up with x minus 8 times x minus 3 times x squared and then this is going to be a plus, remember it's the opposite sign of whatever this is, 3x plus 9. Alright. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Alright. I guess time quit staring at that. So we got x minus 8, and x minus 3, x squared plus 9. It's a lot like the last problem. Seemed like it is. What was this? 9.2? Yeah. Okay. Tricky though. It could be tricky. We're over here at gotomath.com. Practicing how to factor. See you in the next problem.